I'm Margana Stanley, the superintendent of Henderson County Schools, and we are here in the new Spotsville Elementary School Gymnasium. It's an exciting month for Spotsville Elementary School because they will move into their new school in just a few weeks. Another new exciting thing for Spotsville Elementary School is that it was recently named a Blue Ribbon School. Every year, the United States Department of Education seeks out and celebrates great American schools. National Blue Ribbon is a widely recognized symbol of exemplary teaching and learning. Next week, Ms. Sarah Estabrook and a team will be able to travel to Washington, D.C. and receive that Blue Ribbon Award. This will be our second school that will receive a Blue Ribbon Award from the U.S. Department of Education, our first one being East Heights Elementary. A few exciting dates, the next few weeks that you're going to want to know about. November 5th is by invitation only, and that is for our media. November 7th, which will be on a Wednesday afternoon from 4 o'clock to 6 o'clock, we will have the old Spotsville School, located right next to the new one, open so any former alumni can come and walk through that building one last time. At 5 o'clock, we'll do a special photo for any alumni and community folks that would like to come and go through the old school around five o'clock. So you don't want to miss that evening if you want to spend one more time to be able to walk through the old Spotsville Elementary School. The next uh, day that you'll want to make sure you mark on your calendar is November 9th. On November 9th, Spotsville Elementary, only Spotsville Elementary, will dismiss all their students at 11 o'clock. We're doing that so um, we can finish up everything we need to for the students first day on November 12th. When students come to school in the Spotsville area on November 12th, they will come in to the new Spotsville school for class. You certainly won't want to miss November 19th. On November 19th, we will hold our regularly scheduled board meeting here in Spotsville gym at 6 o'clock p.m. We also will have an open house and a ribbon cutting ceremony for all of our community and special guests will be invited. So please mark November 19th on your calendar as well. Inside one of our intermediate classrooms on the second floor at Spotsville Elementary and I have with me Randall Johnson. Great to see you. Nice to see you. He has been our on-site construction manager for several months. So you have watched this project Yes. What What are some of your favorite things that you like about our school design? The big thing is the way the school is laid out, the open hallways, the uh, size of the classrooms, and, and just the overall look of the building outside. Sure. It is a very traditional look. Yes. And that matches the Spotsville community. Yes. And we often say that Spotsville's very rich in traditions, and now we're adding some new additions yes. to it. Um, I noticed down in the library this morning that they are putting the furniture in place. Yes. Um, is, is that layout um, unique, or is it a pretty traditional setting? Uh, it's kind of unique with all the uh, bulkheads in the uh, Media Center, the way it is uh, got radiuses in it and the way everything flows in it, it's open. Mm -hmm. And uh, the really nice thing is a little reading nook that has uh, book stack yeah. columns. That looks very and, sharp. Uh, the children should enjoy it. I very think much. so too. I, th I think so too. And I think the openness is really going to help and play into the innovation of our STEAM and STEM labs that yes. we're putting in all of our elementary schools. And so as kids go into the library, not only is literacy a focus, but they have a lot of space to collaborate and communicate and work with critical thinking. Yes, and then all the technology that's been put into this building is uh, fantastic. Yes, it is. It's top notch. <laughs> it is world class. It certainly is. Well, hey, thanks for your time. All right. Appreciate Thank you. all that you have done in driving this to get us into this building. I appreciate it. Thank, Thank you, you very much. This is certainly going to be an extraordinary month 
for the students, the staff, and the community in Spotsville. I hope you have a great weekend. We look forward to all of our students coming back to class on November 5th. And don't forget, November 6th is Election Day. All Henderson County Schools will be closed. Child Cares will remain open at certain sites. Um, have a great weekend.